Time now to turn to security. The Nigerian Air Force on Wednesday signed three MOUs with three institutions at the Air Force headquarters. Now the focus of these partnerships is for research and development which will enhance the operations of the Air Force. Our defense correspondent, Andana Inga, has more. The Nigerian Air Force is a technology-driven service. The scope of its operations primarily involves the use of various air assets. This means it has to expand the knowledge and capacity of its personnel in the area of research and development. This is why it is signing these MOUs with the University of Benin, Accident Investigation Bureau and the Digital Bridge Institute. The Nigerian Air Force currently overall has 32 active MOUs with a variety of organizations. However, today, three of these memoranda of understanding having recently expired are being renewed. It is not the first time the Air Force is having such partnerships. Similar arrangements with other Nigerian institutions have succeeded. This move is a testament to the confidence it has in indigenous institutions. Through our collaboration with different agencies, the Nigerian Air Force produced autopilot cassettes for the MI-35 helicopters, emergency ventilator system for COVID-19 patients, hydraulic diaphragm for the MI-35 helicopters, and the L-39 trainer aircraft. COVID-19 is still a major factor and a global health challenge. Earlier in the day, a dialysis center at the 063 Nigerian Air Force Hospital is commissioned. It's meant to cut off all those patients with kidney diseases, both our personnel, their families, and our civilians who are living around us. So this is virtually the essence of this center. The Nigerian Air Force is hoping to sustain these initiatives in order to enhance the performance of its personnel across the country. Aonduna Inga, Silverbird, News 24.